I don't like sand. It's coarse and rough and irritating. And it gets everywhere. So you're telling me the protectors are getting reviews before the Toa? I don't like it. Adam Gear 63 fat. Welcome to the review of the Protector of Stone, who, frankly, alongside his potato counterpart, has the most interesting colors of any of these sets. I mean, first I thought it was trans yellow, but it's actually trans neon green. Or, for some of you, just trans yellow. I don't know, some people are crazy. No, you're the crazy one. I see no proof. Uh-huh. But yeah, legit, he has cool colors. So, I'm pretty bummed. <laughs> when the leaked pictures of this guy came out, I fell in love with him. Although I finally get him in my hand six months later, and to be honest, I'm a little underwhelmed. I praised him and the Jungle Protector for having the same reason of being taller and having nicer weapons. And while the Stone Protector has a better weapon, the Jungle one beats him out slightly. But we'll get to that for another day. You goddamn asshole! The main issue I have with the majority of these protectors is their chest. And it's not even the armor that's bad. Oh no, it's, um... Well... The implants! I'm talking about the implants! It's my body and I do what I want with it. Besides, you're one to talk. You're not my real dad! But really, it is a little distracting. Although with a couple of small adjustments, you can condense the chest to make it look a little bit better. And now there's a spot in the back to add armor for a backpack. <laughs> also, on a small note, the armor placement on his legs is super awkward. While they do look more filled in and makes it a little bit different from the jungle protector, Half of the armor like this means his legs are in a constant A stance and they can't go inward a lot. Which kinda sucks. So for the sake of posing, I'm just gonna leave them on the side, because you know that looks a little bit better. So 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 so, so. back on the topic of colors real quick. Trans purple is great and all, I mean you know it looks really really cool, but look at this. Dark orange is back. Am I the only one who cares this much? I mean, it's the same color as the Gaku bird. I mean, we all love the Gaku bird, right? I mean, it's, uh, it, it's a cool color. Leave me alone. So, the staff. Like, it's cool, right? I mean, it's a cool, like, bulky-looking staff, but it looks a little weird, or just doesn't make sense. I mean, it has cool electrical bits on the end of it, but does that mean it's always on? Is it constantly spitting electricity while he has it on his back? I mean, it's, it's kind of... It's kind of weird. And now for our brand new up and coming segment, shooting things at Preston Stormer. Onita, 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 Onita. Which one of y'all dead motherfuckers just said? I put him back at his normal configuration because if I'm gonna give a review of a set, I might as well do it the way it was intended to be built. So, hey, this guy, you know, not a big surprise, he's a repeat offender. Again, he's got ankle-ass ankles, knee-ass knees, hip-ass hips. Ah! But that's it. Um, as you can tell, it's all ball jumped to this guy. Um, no swivels or anything, so... Um, this, um, Predator of Stone's actually a really good example of, like, crazy posability you can get out of this type of thing. I mean, again, if I were to move these out of the way, you can really get some, like crazy like he can just do like some crazy like soccer kick and go Hwah! and that's all that's all fine and dandy but you can tell what the posability is just based on the generic character and creation build system which i think is a really dumb name but there's that again he's got the big big honking chest which is kind of in the way but not terribly it's, like, the only thing that really limits anything is his neck, because he can't look down at all. I mean, he can move side, his head can move side to side, complete up, and just snap his neck back. But, yeah, there's that. Um, again, shoulders. I don't know how I feel, like, I like the whole, like, he's got a shoulder pad here, but nothing here, but I don't know how I feel about these spikes on the feet and on here. I don't think it, like, it, I, I think it fits, but I think it looks a little awkward. I mean, Bahatu has it too, so I don't, I don't know, but, eh. But, you know, he's got, he's got shoulders, he's got elbows, he's got a wrist, and he can snap his hand. Well, I can do that, can I? I can, 
Nope. No, my hand can't go that far back. Well, okay. I broke the toy. I'm sorry. And that's that. Uh, again, something that bothers me. We have to just kind of like nothing here on his back. Which kind of sucks. Because like, that's just a, that's just a ball joint. There's legit just ball joint here in the, in the, um, built-in small hero factory body. So I don't, I don't know what to, just something, just put something there. It's annoying. If you're going to have this big chest, put something here, at least to protect our jungle. Did it. And then we have the staff. Which, um, again, it fires by twisting this little gear and it spins, but then you can still spin this on its own, which is a nice, cool little design. Uh, a couple pieces I want to point out, uh, this little bit here comes with a majority of the protectors. A little, like, axle axle, and there's, like, a little pinhole thing there. Wow, there we go. Another thing to point out is that there is a, there's a five long, uh, like, Technic like thin technic left arm, but it's like three pinholes and then two axle holes on the side, as opposed to the other ones we type we usually get. So that's pretty nifty, if I have to say. Okay, how do I put this back together? Oh, I did it. Whoa. So I don't know if it's just this guy, but I currently have all the protectors, and of all of them, this guy has the worst blaster in terms of keeping all of his studs in place, and that kind of stinks. And also, you know, he's got these little electric spike bits, which, um, I don't know. I mean, it's nice to have them in, like, one solid color, as opposed to having them in, like, a trans, like, oh, here's blue and a little bit of trans green, or, like, here's red and a little bit of trans yellow. Like, I don't know. It's nice to have these in this nice solid color. And he can, he can hold this really well. Like, he can just, like, he can aim it towards the ground, like he is in the, in the box art. He can aim it up. He can just, you know, wield it with one hand and just be a menace. I mean, yeah, man, I don't know. I mean, he, I think this guy, uh, I guess I could say he has the best weapon out of all the protectors in terms of, like, versatility and, like, play value. And he is the most posable, so it works. I mean, for, for posing options and, like, playability, I think this guy and the jungle protector to an extent has that level of nice action figure playability, which is great, you know, it's a really good time. <sighs> now, let's figure out something dumb to do in between this and the outro. What? PROTECTOR OF SOUL! <coughs> also, he comes with a skull spider! Overall, I wish I liked the stone protector more. I mean, it's probably because I hyped him up in my head a lot, but he's still a really cool toy. I mean, he's got really cool colors and a nice weapon and crazy good posability because of all the ball joints he has. I wouldn't overlook him. I mean, a majority of people are picking up all the sets as is, so you're probably going to pick him up eventually if you're in if you're really into the getting this entire line. So, I'd say check him out. He's really worth it. Anyway, guys, this is Shadow Gear Six Two Three Five, and I'll see you folks another time. Turn around and say it again. I am. Er I mean, f fuck, God, wow, 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 Skype just messaged me. But legit, yeah, he has good clothes, blah, 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 wow. Guy, he, I fell in love with him. I mean, I see the hands, oh, wow. I see your hands. What do I have with a majority of these, wow, okay, I got that wrong too. And the chest can be condensed. Oh. Does that mean it's always on? Is it constantly spitting electricity? Did I have to I conceal that burp as I was talking to try and you know hide it? I mean that didn't really work all too great, did it? Oh, that's oh no, I had the right one. Oh. Pediatrician of stall. This is Shadow Gear Six Fifty Five, and I'll see you folks another time. I forgot to say the threes. This is Shadow Gear 6, blah, blah, 5. That's not in the name. I, I, I can't. I, God, God fucking damn!